And there's no surprise that Matty Jukes has found the middle of his back. And that is exactly where Matt Jukes goes to the grandstand for the first boundary. Gives himself some space yeah. and finds space as well. He has peppered that boundary over the last couple of games. Yes. That's the line he likes. Meredith, but oh. it's also a line that Jilks likes as well. Where do you bowl to? Goes on the pull shot. Nicely timed, nicely placed. Yes. You two were speechless before. I think it's almost my turn, isn't it? Oh, you know. Doesn't give width again, and it is double the dose there. The chemist warehouse. Goes fuller, goes straight up, and jilks yet again. That is edged, and finally the Hobart Hurricanes find a way to avoid the middle of Jilks's bat. That is clubbed. Get out the way, everybody. Bowler, umpire. Um, I'm not sure if I've spent enough time with him yet to be able to be able to say he definitely um. He's confident around the group. Hopefully off the pitch. Straight. <laughs> long. <laughs> Sounded good. Looks good. Just holds his shape. It was the shot that he almost went out on the other night. That... Yeah! Chopped on, has he? Yes, he has. Second wicket from the velodrome end, the first to Ellis, the second to Meredith. And it's Riley Russo looking to slash the ball away. Oh, a little tickle, I think. Ollie Davies. Goes for the short boundary and clears it comfortably. Expect a lot of wrong -ins from Darcy Short here. Goes again, Matthew Wade with a long catch. Oh. Flicked off the pads. And a little bit. The ramp that he played. Just holds his shape and doesn't even walk. And why not when you time it that well? This the cricket. Or you just let Alex Hales take it and smash it out of the park. <laughs> Tosses that up, and we've seen a few today already. Some off the pace bowlers, this one off the spin, and it brings up Alex Hale's 50 of just 30 balls. The first player to hit a 50 here in Albury. No. <laughs> Matthew Wade's doing all the commentary for us at the And that's fizzing off the bat as well. Oh, that is some shot there. Drags the length back a little bit. I think Ollie Davies was expecting it and just helped it on its way. Change of pace, and that's got punished as well. This time all the way. And every eight off spin. And then cuts it high, long again. Sky high. Another chance, but a chance just for the crowd, and that one has gone down. So, what does Ollie Davies do? He says, I'll back away, and I'll go up and over, straight over the top. Exactly. And another one, tempting the outstretched hand, but gone in a flash. With wickets in the shed. There's that wide line, and it's scooped up in the air. That has gone to Paddy Dooley. Oh, picks that up nicely, but might have found the fielder and has. Will be well and truly in if this goes all the way. Yes, it will. This is last ball, actually. Catch it, Bravely catch it. tosses it up. The shout is catch it, steadies himself. Changing it up. It's gone from full and wide to back of a length. And he... Oh. Could this be one of the biggest of the day? Look out, Roof. Yep. Bye-bye, ball. Bye-bye. And then it follows it up with the wicket. 
Killed it straight to the fielder, and that's some nice hands, because that, like in a lot of shots today, had some serious pace on it, but uh, Tim David takes it comfortably. You probably look at Nathan, he was disappointed with himself having to get hit for a couple of boundaries. Um, but it's pretty tough going if you miss here. Just... Oh. Through the legs. They're going to go. A hit would have picked up the wicket. In the end, they scamper through for what will be signalled a ball. Doggett with ball. And a single straight away. Now. Oh. And that is handy indeed. He was brilliant with the bat. He is now brilliant in the field. He said he can't do two things at once. Or I beg to differ. Well, Davies called, so that's a lovely short. Darcy Short did, and you put the team under more pressure. He's gone once, we'll go again, and same result. The first one. Oh, right off the full one. Let's just watch and admire once again. Oh. And that's past batter, past keeper, and past the rope. That's it. Gets into the little ramp, finds space on this occasion, though. Sounded beautiful off the blade and into the stadium. Oh. Into the pitch and out of the ground. Toyota, six of note there. Oh, yeah, he's putting on a show here as Matthew Wade. Might be one of the smaller grounds in Big Bash. That's six. But he is making a name for himself here, the Australian, the Tasmanian. Between Davidson Stumps goes Kadir. Yes! Oh, throw him. That's a good point. And Matthew Wade with another bat. Oh, on the pads, and that will race away. As he slices that away, oh. just short. Was it through the hands? It was. Hot. We've had a few wheeze as well. Is that that a bump one, ball? Tell yeah. me it's a bump ball, Mel. Sorry, but I don't think it is. No. Oh, really? Uh, he can clear this fence as well. So look, that's that's a big loss. Matthew Wade is a great player, and uh, the way he played those three ramps were just very special. The more you look at it, the more you. I don't know. I thought initially that's got to be out. And it went so quickly to backward point as well. What was your gut feel, though? Gut feel was out. But, again, the more you look at it, you think... Well, but it's on. like those catches coming forward, isn't it? As soon as you look at a, a 2D image, the decision is through. And Mike Graham-Smith has given Matthew Wade out. And yet again, how many have we seen this afternoon here at Lane? <laughs> We're as bad as bad. Bar <laughs> Jimmy Neesham launching and launching a long way. He's just stood and delivered. Everyone has just watched that one sail over as well. And apologies to everyone if they heard that expletive in this. Oh. <laughs> well, he hit the stumps off a straight drive and he said, let's just take that out of the equation. We will go long, we will hit the sight screen, we'll finish off the over. Cutting. Loses that one. And it might almost be lost in the crowd as well. How is David up? Well, settled a little bit of a trip from David. He's got to get his skates on. He's in trouble, I think. Hesitation might cost him, plus the slip. He doesn't look confident. Um, it's pretty impressive. He's, uh, you know, I, I'm pro Ben a bit biased here, but I sort of count positions where the ball goes sort of most of the time. Catch it, catch it. Come on, Matt. Ali Davies says Come on. catch it. Come on. Shields yes. the eyes from the sun. Oh, how much of it has he got? Not enough. Not enough. Oh. And it's a full toss on the hip. Yeah. Gonski. Oh, catch it. Oh. He has. No. Yes. He has. No. He has, yes. Oh, God. It 
extension in the hands. It's Chris Green backing back, and the captain says, I'll do the umpiring as well. And it slides off the blade. And will it find another boundary? Yes, it will. Chris Green has stepped in and done a wonderful job. Yeah. Through the defences, the skip-up gets the final wicket. Here in the hometown of Lauren Jackson, and the Sydney Thunder have slam-dunked the Hobart Hurricanes.